We're talking about the latest results of the Marquette University Law School poll with the director of the poll, Professor Charles Franklin. Charles, let's begin with the presidential race. Uh, for a number of weeks, we've seen Barack Obama with a lead in this state, but, but things have really tightened up. They've tightened to a, an absolute tie. Barack Obama at 49 percent, Mitt Romney at 48. That's down from an 11-point Obama lead just two weeks ago and reflects the impact of that very critical first presidential debate. The Senate race, Tammy Baldwin, Tommy Thompson, many people thought this would be a tough race. It has been so far. How does it stand right now? That race had narrowed to four points two weeks ago and now is also a dead heat with Thompson at 46 percent and Baldwin at 45. Let's talk for a moment about the, the impact of the debates. And, and, and many people believe that first presidential debate uh, was something of a game changer. Do we see that reflected in the, in the numbers this we, time? We certainly do. Not only did uh, voters think that uh, Governor Romney did best in that debate by a large margin, but in our data, of those who watched the first debate, Romney leads 50 to 48. But among those who did not watch the debate, it's Obama with the lead 50 to 42. Well, clearly, uh, we don't have um, uh, poll results that take into account the debate last night, but we do have poll results that take into account the vice presidential debate. How did Paul Ryan fare in his matchup with Vice President Biden? Pretty well with Wisconsin voters. We asked who did the better job in the debate. 51 percent said Ryan, 42 percent said Biden. Uh, that's a uh, somewhat closer than what we saw in the first presidential debate, uh, but is still a solid performance for both, but especially for Ryan. Charles, give us uh, uh, your take on, on what's happening here in, in the in the Romney-Obama race. It, it seems like people's feelings about Mitt Romney have changed. We see clear evidence of that. Uh, perceptions of the president barely changed before or after the debate. But for Governor Romney, voters saw him as a stronger leader after the presidential debate, and they also saw him as more empathetic, more likely to care about people like you. In both of those, we saw significant movements that improved Governor Romney's standing with voters. And makes for a very close race, at least at this moment in time. We're absolutely at a toss-up stage at this point. Uh, the, the race that had been a little wide has narrowed to as close as it can get. Professor Charles Franklin, we appreciate your time. Thanks very much. Thank you.